Good morning, everyone. I wanted to uh, share uh, something I found out yesterday in Lightburn that uh, might help you in the future. Uh, this is a, a, a photo that I've engraved along with, I'm going to engrave a, a, a frame around this particular picture. And what I was noticing when I was engraving it is there were certain lines that were showing up that were unsightly, and I couldn't understand why. I'll, though I'll, I'll include a picture in this video so you can kind of see what I'm talking about. And I figured out what it was, so I thought I'd share it. So uh, if you have this come up, you'll know how to fix it. First of all, um, in the past, I've used the flood fill feature to save a little time on these uh on these laser projects. And it really doesn't matter which one of these three you use, it seems to show up no matter which one of these you select if you have flood fill on. And so in this particular case, we'll leave it flood fill, we'll go in here, we'll preview, and we're gonna scrub this preview. You notice that it's 21 minutes worth of laser time, and I'll show you kind of what's going on, what's generating the problem for me. So as I scroll and I scrub through this, you're going to notice that all of a sudden it generates this little piece and then it leaves this whole right side kind of blank. It finishes the left side. It leaves another little spot here. And the problem is every time this laser head leaves this and then has to come back and fill this in later, it leaves a little white line or a lighter line and you can see it in the finished product. The other thing is it only does half of her name and then it comes back and does the other half which you can see that division there and so it's just it's not as good quality as you need to provide your customers with. You can see the top of 2020 is not done and we've got these places right in here that the laser has to come back to and finish these up and it's these little places right here, right here here, 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 that you will see a little bit of a white uh, artifact in your finished product. In order to fix that, uh, if I come in here and I turn this flood fill off, and I run another preview, you're going to see that the laser project is just a little bit longer, 22 minutes, 43 seconds. But, but the big difference comes in the, in the output. You'll notice when we scrub this that it starts at the bottom. It completes the name completely. It goes through the frame on both sides, all of the design work. And it doesn't jump around at all. And it makes it a, a much cleaner looking product. And so if you're having white lines in your uh, projects, that could be the problem if you're using this flood fill. So just be careful using this flood fill. It can do weird things to your project. I've had three other projects uh, happen the same thing to, and now that I figured it out, I don't think it's going to be a problem, but hopefully this will help you. You guys have a great day. Thank you.